for the end zone. Touchdown! And the left jab. Takes the shot. Access 7 Sports. For all of your local sports, tune to Access 7. How does it feel to be the captain, uh, especially in such a special year, hosting the Memorial Cup and the 100th season? Yeah, it's, uh, it's a huge honor to be, to, be, to be named captain, but especially in a year like this with the Memorial Cup 100th year, it's, uh, it's uh, pretty special and something that uh, you know, I don't take lightly. What does being captain mean to you? What, what do you want to bring as a captain? Um, well, you know, I think bring what a good captain brings. Um, just lead by example every day and, uh, you know, continue to work hard. And, um, yeah, it's a big year, so just lead by example. Who have you taken the most from in terms of past captains? So? Uh, well, there's been a lot of great captains here. Um, you can't pick one, you know, each bring different things and uh, you know they, they've all been great and I've been lucky to uh, you know play with those guys. Is it going to change your job at all Sam do you think? Um, in terms of what I do on the ice and everything I don't, I don't think so. Uh, you know I just need to play my game and, and stuff but you know off the ice when you become captain there's definitely some things that you're you're leaned on it to a little bit more so um, I think a little bit yeah. Have you ever thought about being a captain before today? Uh, well, I mean, I've been a captain growing up, so obviously not at this stage. But uh, you know, I, you know, when I got drafted here, I, I, I don't know if I imagined being captain one day, but it's, it's uh, definitely an honor to be named. Are you one to step up in the locker room when something needs to be said, or, or do you really just let the play on the ice do the talking? Uh, well, I think play on the ice is really important, but also you need to, you know, step up when the time's right in the locker room and. Uh, lead by example and also, uh, you know, like I said, speak up when the time's right. Relying on some of the, the other guys with you, is, do you feel like that's a strong leadership core? A lot of you guys is like that have been leaned on in the last couple of years to, to lead this group. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, there's a lot of great guys and, you know, those guys, I think they bring a lot and they're great leaders. So um, I think, you know, our group right here is, is awesome, but I think there's a lot of more guys in the room that uh, are definitely leaders too. Watching a guy, even like Adam or Colby, the last couple of years, do you kind of see what it takes to be a captain and what it means to be a leader on a team like this? Yeah, like I said, we've had uh, a lot of good captains here. Uh, they all bring something a little different, but um, I've been lucky to play with those guys and, and learn from them. Sam, you're, you're considered maybe, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but maybe a little more of a quiet guy, a little more soft-spoken. Are you, are you ready to kind of be a louder voice? Do you think that's part of it? Uh, like I said, there's there's times when you need to speak up, but I think leading by example is important too. So uh, it's it's a little bit of both. When's the last time you wore a C at any level? Uh, Bantam, Bantam. Yeah, I was captain. Do you feel anything extra on your shoulders because of you know what's going on with this team this year? Uh, it, it is a big year. Um, I don't think it changes my job a whole lot. You know, you need to, you know, whether it's, you know, it's, it's a really big year, so you need to lead the way you would regardless, so, yeah. You'd be the first one to touch the Memorial Cup if you thought that far ahead yet. Uh, <laughs> no, but now that you bring it up, it, uh, it sounds pretty special, so uh, that's obviously the goal, so hopefully we'll get there. A lot of work to get there, uh, starting with some preseason. Are you excited to maybe get going this weekend, or are you going to take time off before you head to Anaheim? Uh, I'm not completely sure what the plan is now, but uh, it's yeah, it's it's good to get things going. Has it been nice to get back with this group, though, and, and the familiarity comes back from last year? Yeah, for sure. Uh, it's always exciting to come back and see all the familiar faces and meet some new guys, too. So. Uh, you know, we all enjoy coming back and seeing each other. Every leadership group has a you know a mix of personalities. Everybody's a little different. What do you what can you offer about this group of guys? Well, I think just what you said. They're all different, whether they you know you know that they're different from the outside or not. Uh, they are all good players. They all uh, have great preparation, and uh, you know they're they're. The players are going to be counted on, and they're counted on now in just a little bit more important way. 
Why is Sam the right guy to lead this team on a Memorial Cup year? Uh, you don't have to be the best player, but that's an, that's a valuable point if you are. Um, but I think past that, it's his it's his preparation, it's his uh, work on his game. Um, you know, quite often he's the last person off the ice, and that's you know not necessarily amazing or or. Uh, not the first best player on a team to be the last guy off the ice, but when he does, he sets an example. And, and if there's others that should be on there, just by the fact he's doing it, they, then they should be embarrassed. Do so you need mentioned. to be more vocal this year? Uh, I think he needs to be vocal, just like he mentioned, you know, at the time he steps up. I'm assuming, not assuming, I sort of know, assuming that he's done that before. Um, he's worn a letter for the last two years. Um, so. You know, him and then the other three guys are uh, captains are and why we picked them. I never believed in players picking them is because they're an extension of the coaching staff. So they will and are expected to carry across that whatever our message is at different times. From us, it's, they're an extension of us and to get it across and go out and do it. What qualities do you look for in captain? Uh, just that dedication. Um, be able to read people, uh, you know, not necessarily have to be around a, this, a certain group a long time, but when you're around them, you get to know them, you get to know their personalities, and, uh, you know, be willing to do what it takes to win a game, whether it's, you know, block a shot, win a face-off, whether it's, um, you know, speak to somebody on the team, you know, whether it's to come to us with different things. Like I said, they're an extension of the coaching staff.